ESLE 2019, Paper 2, Question 16. The figure is formed by five identical semicircles. A. What is the diameter of each semicircle? B. Using the calculator value of pi to find the perimeter of the figure. Round your answer to two decimal places. Firstly, I'm going to draw two vertical lines to mark the two ends of this figure. Next, I'm going to deal with the top part where we see three semicircles and we have two straight lines with the measurements 12 and 12. So what we are going to do is, since all the semicircles are the same, I'm going to push all of them to the left and I'm going to push the straight lines to the right. With the two straight lines on the right, now we can add them up. 12 and 12 will get us 24 centimeters. I will now do the same with the two semicircles on the bottom. I'm going to push them to the left. Then I'm going to push the three straight lines, 22, 16, and 22, all the way to the right. That will get me 60 centimeters. If you do a comparison between the top half and the bottom half, you will find that we are able to solve for the diameter of one circle, which is actually 60 centimeters minus 24 centimeters. That will get us 36 centimeters. In B, all we need to do to find the perimeter is to add the straight lines and to add the five semicircles. So let's start with the five straight lines. We have 22, 12, 16, 12, and 22. We need to add these five lines together to get us 84 centimeters. Next, we will have to add the five semicircles. Now, we know a semicircle formula is half times pi times d. Alright, so five semicircles will become five multiplied by half, multiplied by pi, multiplied by 36. That will get us 90 pi centimeters. To find the total perimeter, all we need to do is add 84 to your 90 pi. Use the calculator pi to do the conversion, we will get 366.74 centimeters. Thank you.